Ukraine aid, rejected Kiev's wishes but Britain not sure, long-range weapons won't stop Russia? Britain and Turkey have spoken out about supplying Ukraine with heavy weapons, while Russia has warned that long-range weapons will not change Moscow's military goals. In an interview on TRT television on February 1, Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan said that the transfer of tanks cannot be said to be one of the factors to resolve the conflict, but rather a risk. And it benefits the weapon tycoons. Meanwhile, British Defence Secretary Ben Wallace said that the UK had not made a firm decision on not sending fighter jets to Ukraine when asked about this issue. Mr Wallace emphasised, I have been involved in this for a long time. And I learned two things, not asserting anything and not rejecting anything. This is not a firm decision. However, the British official insisted that transferring fighter jets to Kiev at this time is not the right approach because what will change the conflict this year will be Ukraine's ability to deploy Western weapons against Russia. Kiev has begun asking military sponsors for modern fighter jets and longer-range missiles to hit targets deeper inside Russian-controlled territory. In this regard, on the same day, Kremlin spokesman Dmitry Peskov said that the transfer of any long-range weapons to Ukraine by Western countries does not change Moscow's military goals in the neighboring country. This or the situation of fighting on the field. According to Peskov, this is a direct path to increasing tensions and escalating conflicts. This will force us to work harder. But again, the course of events will not change. The special military operation will continue. The Kremlin representative also confirmed that Russia is not currently considering any new plans to promote dialogue between President Vladimir Putin and his Ukrainian counterpart Volodymyr Zelensky. Also on February 1st, during a government meeting, President Putin said that the country's military must stop shelling from Ukraine's territory to the southwest of Russia, which he believes is the cause of many lose their home or lose power.